guys and welcome to my channel my 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 channel hey hey guys we made it to 600 subscribers on YouTube y'all and we are growing so if you were here before my 1k mark I'm not on that yet but you know I'm speaking into existence okay 1k here we come so if you're not subscribing you're watching this please click, click that subscribe button anyways today's video is gonna be about me trying this cool website called foundation I just lowered the brightness on my camera because that mug was too bright and I want you guys to see when I actually try out this foundation. So guys, on the foundation website, step one says to enter a brand of foundation or concealer that you wear. And so far, I've only been really sticking to one foundation because it doesn't irritate my skin. And you know, I just don't like trying new things when I'm spending my own money on it. Because when I did try to try new things, that foundation color was way off, even though I asked someone in Target for help. But we'll make a video on that later. Anyways, the foundation that I love to use is CoverGirl Ready Set Stay. Ready Set something? We'll see, because I don't know if I remember all the way. Ready Set. Okay, I see they have my foundation. It's called Ready Set Gorgeous. Ready Set Gorgeous. That's my favorite word, gorgeous, because it's such the G. <laughs> and my name starts with the G. Anyways, guys, we're going to see what other foundation will match my skin based on the foundation that I wear. It says that the matches will be more accurate if you enter another foundation that you use. And a other foundation that I use way, way before I used the CoverGirl Set Go was a foundation from that I used to get from Family Dollars because you know I was really, really broke. I'm still broke. That's why I still use that CoverGirl Ready Set Gorgeous foundation. But anyways, the other foundation that I used to use is of course Black Radiance. Like I know most of y'all use that stuff too. Black Radiance and the color chocolate. I remember that because it smelled like chocolate. It was True Complexion BB Cream. And I have to end the color chocolates. Find my matches anyways. Let's see. Black Radiance, I have to wear, I wear chocolate on that. Soft Sable and CoverGirl. CoverGirl Queen Collection Flawless. Oh, I think I put it on. Wait, why is it only showing me CoverGirl? Oh, it's not only showing me CoverGirl. It's showing me Mary Kay as well. So let's see. Hmm. Okay, black radiance. I wonder what I wear in. Let me find an expensive. What's an expensive brand? I wonder where I wear, what I wear in Benefits Cosmetics. I hear a lot of people talking about Benefits Cosmetics. So my color would be in Benefits Cosmetic. It would be Nutmeg. That's what it says. How much is that mug? Hmm. Forty eight dollars for uh, what's this? Flawless powder foundation, like y'all tripping, bro. Anyways, we're gonna stick to, stick to CoverGirl. Let's see if I can find the CoverGirl foundation that I can use. Let's see, CoverGirl, CoverGirl, CoverGirl. Cover 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 this actually, this actually lets you type in what other foundations, what other foundations that, you that you actually just want to see. It, it lets you filter it matches by brand. So let's just do that. So let's CoverGirl. Cover cover Bro, that's it. I put, I put NARS. NARS. I can't, I can't. I can't afford NARS. NARS. No thanks. Okay, where's, where's the, the little... How do I enter this information? I don't want color calls. I said cover girl, girl, man. Cover girl. girl. Okay, like... Stop acting stupid. Okay, so... How do I search it? I don't know how to search this junk. Like, how do I search it? It's changing, man. Okay. It was my fault. I didn't know that I was clicking the other thing by accident for some reason. Okay, so we're gonna try out try the cover girl. Hmm. Let's see what cover girl products should we try. Okay, we're gonna try the cover girl true blend foundation. And it says my, my color is. Is that my color, bro? Yo, I don't think I put the right foundation for my CoverGirl. What was it? I don't remember what color it was. I literally had it, and then I don't know where it went. Is it? Em I have an empty bottle of my old foundation. That Sony don't even sound like it's for black skin. Let me, let me remove that junk and let's start over. Add another foundation. CoverGirl. Okay. Okay. Ready, set. 
gorgeous. Let's try, let's try 370. Okay, let's try 270. Let's try dark. Dang it, what is it? Let's try 215. Warm beige. That don't sound right. What is it? You guys, I really think it's 320. Like when I envision it in my head, I'm I'm seeing the 320 label pop up. Let me just put 320. Oh my goodness, why can't I? And I looked everywhere for the bottle. I looked in the trash can. It's not there. Like, I honestly don't know where I put it. <laughs> Cover girl. Let me put Ready, Set, Gorgeous again. Ready, Set, Gorgeous foundation. 320. Let's go with 320. Find my matches. Okay, all I want is to filter it by up the Cover Girl again. It says filter. Do they have the Queen Collection Flawless Foundation? Let me see what foundation I want. True Blend. Let's try True Blend. Okay. Now this color looks way more like my color. I don't know what's going on with that other shade, but Tony, that was not for me. Like I was going to like a straight up ghost if I put that on my face. Like oh, anyways, guys, it says my best match is D70 Cappuccino. Okay, so that's the best match for me. And we're about to head out to the store and find this foundation, okay? Be right back. A few moments later. Okay guys, I am back with my foundation and I went to Walmart and the total foundation was $7.98. My original foundation is usually like about $5. So this is like pricier than the ones I usually pay that was like almost eight dollars so I was like hoping that this is my foundation because eight dollars is close to ten dollars and I'm not spending ten dollars on foundation again and, and not being my color even though I should have returned the other one I really should have returned the other one but I was in denial so I got the foundation this is it right here and we're about to put it on this canvas as you can tell I've been having my eyebrows and my eyeshadow makeup done So let's get started. I'm gonna grab my e.l.f. brush that I don't clean. And we're gonna just squeeze this thing onto the brush. You know, I'm gonna do it like this because I've seen a lot of people do it like this. I should get a mirror for this. So I got my D70 12 hour stay matte foundation from CoverGirl True Blend. This foundation says it's a comfort matte finish an oil-free formula which is good because I have very oily skin and I don't need anything being oily I usually don't put a whole bunch of foundation on my face which is terrible so I'm gonna put put it enough for it to be full coverage okay let's see please don't disappoint me foundation because you was almost ten dollars okay oh I love how it has like a little lock thingy you can like unlock it and whatnot okay let's just put this on my face we're just gonna squeeze it onto my face and see how it is. I do not like this lipstick. <laughs> Hopefully this is my color because we're gonna have to fight. <laughs> Foundation. Let's see. It looks like it so far. It looks like it's blending in pretty good, bro. Okay, okay, this thing is, is working, it's going into my skin, like, it's blending, let's blend under my chin. And it actually is better than the Cover Girl Ready Set Go, because that one was more ashy, and this one is more like, a little saturated. It's more. It has more of a warm tone. The other one was much of a cool tone. I love the new formula. I add more guys. I think we shall. Let me put some on my forehead first. Oh my gosh! I hate this thing. It's always sticking up. I know y'all be seeing that in my other videos. Like this junk 
be sticking off and you guys won't be telling me anything. It's very rude. Let's just add some more. My forehead. I'm looking at the camera, but I can't see nothing. So, so my forehead. Bend that much. I put that thing on my headband. Let's just hide the rest of my forehead. This is the final product. I didn't add any highlight. This is just how it looks. This is the foundation. And I can say, y'all, foundation did not do me wrong. It did me really right. And we're not going to fight. It matched me up to the T. To the T. To the T. Hold on. Let me put some more on my neck. I don't know, guys. I think it looks pretty good. I think it looks pretty good. Well, you guys need to tell me. Tell me how you think it looks, okay? Anyways, guys, this video was not sponsored by foundation, but foundation did me. Right. I give foundation an A+. Plus. So don't be afraid to try out foundation because that website really works, okay? So. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Bye.